Hey everyone, today I want to talk about why a lot of K-pop fans recently have been really upset and disappointed with Hyuna. Recently, Hyuna seemingly made her relationship with this man, Young Jin Young, public. If you don't know who this man is, let me just give you a very short and basic rundown because honestly, this man does not deserve any more attention. Jun Hyung is a former member of the group Highlight and was involved in the Burning Sun scandal. It was revealed that Jun Hyung received and viewed illegally filmed video footage from Jung Jun Young and partook in inappropriate conversations. Basically, he knowingly viewed videos taken of women without their consent. He announced his departure from Highlight in 2019 in a statement which also included this, quote, Although I knew of what was happening during the time, I thought of it as not a big deal and acted at ease. I was a silent bystander about this severe issue where several more victims may have arisen due to my actions. Yep, you're right about that. And this is who Hyanna is dating right now. So why is everyone mad at her? Well, Hyanna has been in the industry for a while and faced a lot of sexualization and harassment even when she was a minor through news outlets, haters, etc. about her fashion, music, lyrics, and other choices. Voices. That has not stopped her from being bold and thus a lot of people found her to be very inspiring. While she hasn't explicitly mentioned much about topics such as feminism and sexual agency, her actions in the industry were sort of a statement towards such issues which meant people aligned her with these ideals. So when it came out that she was dating someone who was involved in the exploitation of a woman and knowingly so, a lot of her fans and the general public were understandably upset. It's not that they place his blame on her, we already know he's not a good person, but Hyanna dating him seems like a complete departure from what she seemed to stand for. And besides that, this news was huge in Korea and internationally, so it's not like she didn't know. She knows, and she is still with him. I think that's what makes people the most upset. There is a lot of people who also blame her for Don's career. If you didn't know, Hina and Don had a very public relationship and it came out during the early years of the group Pentagon's debut, a group that Don was a part of. He was definitely the most popular member in the beginning because of his charisma and their song Shine had them on track to be a huge group. However, due to the strong rules against dating in K-pop, the news of Hyanna and Don dating meant that their company Cube Entertainment kicked both of them out. While it was rough for both of them, obviously, it was a lot worse for Don as this was the beginning of his career. Hyanna had years of fame behind her that meant that she could jump back on her feet relatively easier than Don. The two have since broken up and people think that Hyanna was the reason he was kicked out of his group, which led to a significant decrease in popularity for both Don and Pentagon, only for her to then break up with him and end up with this dude. I personally don't think it is fair to blame her for this. It takes two people to be in a relationship and Don and Hannah made that decision together. While I was not there for their breakup because I don't know them personally, I can assume that that was also a decision made between two adults. The only guilty party in this ordeal remains Cube Entertainment and entertainment companies in general who think it's okay to enforce laws upon K-pop idols' personal lives. So while I do not think it's fair to blame Hannah for Don, I do feel very disappointed and icked out by Hannah's new choice in men. I think the message she has either indirectly or directly put out through her actions and music lead people to believe that she was different and a lot better than this and we were let down by this news. So let me know what you think about this in the comments because while I do think it's not okay to put ourselves in the personal lives of other people, situations like this definitely warrant disappointment and I can also understand people unfollowing and unstanding her.